Hi, welcome to Ikate's Crossing. Okay, I'm on day three, sorting through the um, Selhain, sorry, Selhain Oracle. Um, just added the next eight to the um, pack, that's what I'm learning. So, shuffling up. what spread am I going to do next from this book as I've added a few more cards to what I've, what I've learnt so far written up on my blog my own thoughts my own opinions so let's have a look at the let's have a look at the spiritual council spread Connecting with my guides. Use a simple spread for receiving spiritual guidance from or connecting with your spiritual support team. So card number one, what do my ancestors and guides want me to know now? Why are they telling me this? And how can I better receive their guidance? So let's have a look at the spiritual council spread. Okay, that's it there. Card one, two, and three okay so let's have a look so what do my ancestors and guides want me to know now there's a journey ahead for me so it's really talking about my journey at this time they want me to know about my journey, maybe it's long, maybe there's still a lot for me to travel upon. How can I, okay, why are they telling me this? Why are they telling me this? Let's have a look. Oh, maybe because there's some toxicity that I need to be aware of in my journey. My journey might be dark. There might be a sense of it could be a toxic journey that I just need to be aware of. How can I better receive their guidance? By looking at what's haunting me at this time. So, my guides want me to know about the journey that I'm traveling. Why are they telling me? Maybe because there could be some toxicity within this journey that I need to be aware of. So how can I better receive their guide, guidance? By looking at what's actually haunting me. What's, um, what seems to sort of being, I feel like it's like a repeated pattern. Maybe something that's not really good for me and I think that's what the toxicity could be. So it might be something that I need to look at. Interesting. So that's going to be an interesting message for me to reflect on with this um, journey as I continue to learn what these cards mean to me. I know the guidebook got some brilliant um, information which are great for more information, but what I'm doing at the moment as I'm sort of deep diving into these cards is looking about what the cards actually mean to me. That's what I mean by deep diving. I don't mean that I'm actually diving deep into the imagery and the stuff like that well that I am but in a few words what does the card actually mean to me quickly without sort of diving um, without looking at the book the guidebook so that's what this means for me is just looking at what the meaning what cards actually mean to me in this moment so I've added a few more cards to it as you can see so um, definitely up to about card 25 think is what I was up to yeah mischief I think was the last one that I looked at here so yeah so that's it from me don't forget to check the links down below check the links on my channel like subscribe and ring the bell so you know when the next video will be uploaded take care and blessed peace